Girls, come downstairs. Someone's here to see you. Clementine! Hi, girls. Oh my gosh, I can't go oh here. here. It's been so long. Oh my it's gosh, I missed you. I'm so happy that I could make it. My semester two classes just lit out, and I could not wait to see you all. Where's Howie? Work. Ugh, I should have known. What favorite hard-working uncle of mine would be? So Cameron, how does it feel to be in your final high school summer? Just amazing. I cannot believe I'm going to be a senior next year. And my little clo clo what's my almost 10th grader feeling? You should know. You're in your second year of college. You've been where I am before. Ah, uh, the sensation. Oh my gosh. I love, love, love what you've done with the place since I was here last. The yellow throughout just emphasizes everything else in the room. Hmm, good counter space. And wow, a um, mix match. Mom seating. I think she's going to design a so unique. Well, honey, that is what she's going to school for. And Aunt Marley, I can only imagine how long you had to beg your hubby of yours for that amazing wall piece over there. So feminine and gorgeous. Why, thank you, Clementine. Can I get you anything? It's almost dinner time. Do you have any Sierra Mist? I haven't had any caffeine today since my flight from Detroit. It tasted awful. We do have some in the fridge. Would you like some? Oh my dog, yes please. Chloe, would you go get her Sierra Mist? Now, Clementine, I know it's been a while. And I should probably remind you that there is no cussing in this household. Our creator's name in vain is a very serious matter. Oh, I so forgot. I, oh, my dog, I am so sorry. Oh, I mean, gosh, sorry. Thank you, Chloe. I have so much to tell you guys. Would you like to take a seat, Clem? Oh, yes, please. <laughs> Let's talk. Oh, where to begin? Um, I should really go study. Why don't you come listen to your cousin, honey? Math can wait, can't it? Actually, it's course two calculus that I'm starting up next year as a part of honors. I really need- Oh, it's summer! Kick back, let loose, wade in the pool? Do you really study during the summer? Chloe is very focused on her studies. She always has been, even before she joined student government. Student Gov? Impressive. Yes, Chloe is quite a little scholar. Now come here, Chloe. Come spend some time with Clementine. She hasn't been here in years. No, no. Let her study. I always wish I had been more of a hard worker in my grade school days anyway. Are you sure? Of course I am. Your mother and I talked over the phone earlier. I'll be staying here for the whole summer. I'll get to see you lots. Go. Um... Okay. Hey. You know, I really wish you would have stayed with us. She had some really cool things to share. And I'm pretty sure that they're cooler than, uh... Problem 81 there. What the heck is a parabola next to... XY squared? times e times 6 over 1 and a half anyway. Well, a parabola is a line on the graph that corresponds to... I don't really want to know. My point is, school got out two days ago. You have all summer to study. Clem will be here all summer too. Besides, she gave me permission. Oh, permission my tail. She didn't really want you to leave us down there for some... Hey! for some algebra papers put into a book spine. The algebra title is just a cover. I got weird looks from everyone carrying around such advanced material last year. Okay, whatever. Just try not to be so conceited next time, okay? Please? Conceited? Okay, so conceited is not the right word, but just try not to be so, so smart-tailed next time, okay? Where are you going? What do you mean? We're watching Pirates of the Claw Rebean downstairs. Clem wanted to watch it. 
It's almost 9.30. You just spent three hours with that chatterbox. As much as I love her, I think it's time we go to bed. So you're not watching the movie either, huh? Mm -mm. See yourself. Go to bed with all the other seven-year-olds in this country instead of having some family time with Pirates of the Clawerbean. Do I look seven, Cameron? No, but you're acting like you are. You can join us if you like. Clem would really like it if you did. Nope. 9.30, remember? Just be quiet when you come upstairs, okay? Fine. Good night. Good night. Love you. Chloe, you could have done better. Clem deserves better than how you treated her. What? Who is this? It's no one, Chloe. You're dreaming. What's going on? Who are you? Be good, Chloe. You must. Who are you? Treat Clementine better. You know that. Who are you? You're dreaming, Chloe. It's okay. Just spend some time with your cousin. It's not my fault. I had to study. What's going on? Be good. No! Yes. Why? Why do I have to be good? You must. No! No! You must or else. Or else what? You're just a dream. What can you do? I am just a dream, but I can do many things. So what's the or else? Or else, I come. Good morning, sleepyhead. Rise and shine. You're up early. Not really. I'm always up at this time if I need to think. So, today I was hoping that we could do a little sightseeing. You know, it's not every day I get to be by the beach. You know what? I think that we should go to the Sunshore Club. I haven't been there since I was in high school. What do you say? I like the club. The little grill and buffet serves really good food. All right then, it's settled. When do you think Cam will be up around noon? So... According to the kitchen clock, about five and a half hours. Good morning, girls. I just wanted to start the coffee for Howie and I. What do you plan on doing today? Well, Chloe and I decided that we should go to the Sunshore Club once Cameron wakes up for the afternoon. Well, that sounds like fun. Oh, coffee's ready. All right, girls, I'm going to go back upstairs, get some more sleep. You guys can leave whatever you want. Cameron's keys are on the... Eh, I don't know where they are. Just find them. Oh. <sighs> Adios. I think I'm going to go wake your sister up, whether she likes it or not. You get ready, okay? I'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, number 50. Order up. We're here, guys. All right, where to? I see Yasmin, see ya. Oh, um, okay. Uh, I guess it's just the two of us, Clobear. Where to? Gondolas? Don't oh. call me. Don't I, call me. I really need to study, okay? I'm just gonna go grab a bite and Don't uh, review. You go over with Cam, I'll be over soon. Uh, are you sure? I need to study. Let's do the girl thing sometime later. Okay, Chloe. Be safe. Hey, sugar. What can I get for you? Uh, hi. Can I just get number 31, please? With a Sprite? Sure thing, honey. We'll whip that right up for you. You're number 54, okay? Go sit down. Okay, time to study. Number 82, graphing extended. 
corresponding with the parabolas. No, don't cry. What is with me? Are you studying? Um, yeah. At the club? Yeah. Loser! <laughs> what? We got ourselves a studier! Right over there! <laughs> 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 I'm gonna go find Clem. <laughs> okay. Truth or dare? Dare, man. Okay then. I dare you to go hug that cat over there. Uh, hi. Dude, is this some kind of sick stroke? I won't take that dare. I knew you wouldn't, bro. Even I wouldn't take that dare. <laughs> uh, BJ, why don't we go ask her? She's like the only one we haven't taken the survey on yet. Her? Christina, are you crazy? That's Chloe. She's like the meanest person ever. Meaner than like Beatrice. What does she do? She like gives people the death stare for no reason. And like... She's always ready to insult you if you do, like, one unsmart thing. Like, totally mean. <laughs> Everyone hates me. Everyone hates me. I'm stuck up and smart and I'm mean. But I am. I can't even spend a second away from my calculus book to go spend time with a cousin who I haven't seen in years. <laughs> don't, Chloe. I have to. No, you don't. All I need is a new makeover. And a new attitude. Things will work out perfectly. There are certain things about you that we can change, Chloe. But this is not one of them. 